Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. Salaam khan here. And with another basic signal today. Today we discuss the unit ramp signal. Okay. So let me give the heading unit ramp signal. Okay. Now this is again you would have seen me using this term often. So this is a basic signal. Now this ramp signal this is represented by an R of T represented by an R of T and the value of this function is equal to zero when the time is less than zero and it's equal to the value of time when time is greater than or equal to zero. Simple as it is. So do you know uh, y is equal to x? The graph y is equal to x graph is what? This is an identity function, right? This is what? This is an identity function. And the graph of the identity function lies in the first and the third quadrant like this. So similar is the case for this function. But this does not exist for the negative values of t as this exists. Right? So as we have the equation of a line in y is equal to mx plus c. So have a look. The, over here the value of y we have is r of t and the value of x this is equal to the, uh, the, the x axis which is the value of time. So have a look. The slope is 1. m is equal to 1 and the intercept is 0. The y intercept is 0. So m is equal to 1 means what? It means the same theta is equal to 45 degrees and theta is measured uh, in the counterclockwise direction. So which means it is the same function but it does not exist for the negative values of time. So r of t is represented like this. This is your t this is r of t and this is your function is that function so that's about it okay that's about it now uh, if you uh, similarly similarly you can also have it in the in the discrete time domain this we, we, we I truly for the continuous time uh, similarly if you have the discrete time so again r of n in that case it would be what it would be 0 for n less than 0 and it would be n for n greater than or equal to 0 and how do you draw it graphically so it would be like this if these are the values of n this is the value for r of n so you have it gradually increasing function this is 1 this is 2 3 4 5 and so on so have a look this is just a staircase increasing gradually so if you uh, want to talk about some properties, so if you integrate the unit step function, you get the RAM function. And I believe I've already told you in one of my previous videos that the RAM function is equal to the integration of negative infinity to t, let's say u of tau d tau. But this value of t, you have the condition that t should be greater than 0. It should lie on the positive side of the plane. So, uh, if, if I do the integration, so u of t is, you know, it's 0 for when t is from negative infinity to 0. So negative infinity to 0, you have the unit step function as 0. So the integration would be 0. The limits I change to tau and then you have from 0 to the, any positive value t, you have the value of u of t as 1. So the integration will give you a t, right? And this t, can I not write it as t times 1 and the value of t, we already know it's greater than 0. So if you are multiplying it with a t greater than 0, so can I not say that this is t multiplied u of t? So this is the relationship. You have the integration or you have this relationship with the RAM and the step signal. Secondly, we check if this RAM signal is an odd signal or an even signal. So, uh, so first, what do you do? You flip the signal around the y-axis to check r of minus t. We check if this is even or is it odd. So, what do you do is that you have r of minus t. 
So R of minus T means what? You flip the signal around the Y axis. So this is the signal. So have a look. R of T uh, is not equal to R of minus T. So which means this is not an odd. This is not an even signal. It's not equal to R of minus T. So this is not an even. And similarly for odd signal, now you take the minus of R of minus T, which means now you amplitude reverse it, and that means you take the the, the mirror image about the the x-axis. So if you have minus times R of minus T, so this would now lie in the third quadrant, and this is the case. So have a look. This is not equal to R of T as well. So this is not equal to this so which means that this signal is neither even nor odd signal is that okay and finally we check if this signal is uh, a power signal or an energy signal is this a power signal is this an energy signal so now you know for from the uh, formula you have a limit 1 over t and this and that so you know the formula is what it's limit t tending infinity 1 over t and the integration from negative infinity to uh, t or whatever uh, the modulus of x of t whole squared with respect to t so have a look i can say limit t tending infinity and from negative infinity to zero uh, wait, 1 over t and then from negative infinity to 0 the value of the function is 0 and then from 0 to any value of t uh, so the value is now what? it's t so the, the, the squared of t would be t squared and with respect to t so now the integration would give you a limit wait, limit t tending infinity 1 over t and t squared so it will have a t cubed by 3 and you have put the upper limit so you have a t cubed upon 3 so cube will cancel out with this t so you have a t squared upon 3 right and now you put the limit so you get an infinity as the answer so which means that this uh, power is infinite so this is not a power signal so now we check for energy and energy is what uh, energy is what energy is powered by time so again you know if you calculate the energy in the same way so you will get the energy also equal to infinity uh, so you can say that this is neither energy nor power signal is that okay and, and you could also have uh, said it from the properties okay I told you in the properties that you have this is what this is an infinite extension signal infinite extension signal with increasing amplitude so this sort of a signal is what this sort of a signal is neither energy nor power signal that's all about it that's all about the ram signal see in the next lecture very soon with most probably rectangular function till then take care of yourselves and everyone around you goodbye